There's nothing in the Bible that talks about retirement. And yet it's been an accepted concept in our culture today. And you think back, the example I think of is Noah. How old was Noah when he built the ark? 600. He wasn't like cashing Social Security checks. He wasn't hanging out. He was working. plan for retirement? And the answer, my friends, say it with me now. You should. <laughs> what? What? You shouldn't. Look at me. I'm 600. And you don't see me. You're 600? Why? Of course he is. 600 is the new 500. <laughs> oh, I know. But 600, that's crazy. Well, hey, are you going to take the Bible literally or not? <laughs> You look older than Noah. My point is, <laughs> so if you wear sunblock, like I tell you. Oh, hey, again with the sunblock. Sunblock, yes, that is my point. You don't see me sitting on a beach somewhere, sniffing on sunblock, cashing in social security checks. No. God gave me a job to do, and I am doing it. Oh, uh, yeah, what, what is that the thing you're building well, out no, there? Let's not worry about that. Well, you shouldn't, because... God is about to kill you all anyway. So you see, my friends, there is no use in planning for your retirement when God is about to drown you all anyway. <laughs> you going to drown us? No, that's a bunch. What? Oh, my right. You're going to be all warm and cozy in that, that uh, ark of yours while we're drowning. Carson Taylor, the mayor of Bozeman. And I need to say at the outset that I am not here on official Bozeman business. <laughs> and that whatever gets said on the stage is not the official policy of the citizens of Bozeman, the city commission, or the city of Bozeman at all. However, as a mayor, I've become very aware that there are many people in the United States that take things very, very literally. <laughs> For example, candidate Greg Gianforte helped to fund a $1.5 million creationist dinosaur museum in Glendive, Montana. So, in case you were to take this sketch at face value, we would like to point out a metaphor that exists within this piece of work. <laughs> that arc is like your retirement plan. You're going to be just fine and we're not. So, <laughs> to interpret the metaphor, let's suppose this fine woman right here sold her business for a billion dollars and then suggested that nobody should retire. <laughs> That might compare to having a boat while everybody else drowns. <laughs> See how that works? Metaphor. Very powerful. <laughs> right. I, for one, am not satisfied with this retirement planning advice seminar. You, Noah, will be very displeased with your Yelp review. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>